What is going on today, YouTube? How are you guys doing? What I'm here to show you guys today is how to generate voltage or electricity using nothing but a candle. So, basically, what you're going to need to make something like this happen is this little device here. It's called the Peltier cooler. What these are designed to do is to cool down your processor instead of just, uh, it's basically an alternative to liquid cooling. Um, a lot of those 12 volt car coolers and things like that have them in it. So I went ahead and ordered myself some. They're pretty cheap if you look around. Um, key thing is you got to look around. This is the part number on that. I'll show it again later once I show the uh, detailed build list there. So let's see what you need. So a few of the things that you'll need. One is a heat sink just for a regular CPU. Nothing special. That's all that is. Number two, just a scrap piece of metal. Be preferable if it has a hole on the bottom of it. That's made out of aluminum as well. Third thing, this is what's called a Peltier cooler. The original usage for these are you apply voltage to these ends. Sorry, there we go, these ends. One side gets hot, one side gets cold. If you put that in between a processor, you can cool your processor. This is a 12 volt model. I'll give you an up close shot of that. So basically, what you're gonna end up doing after you determine which side is hot and which side is cold, you do that by applying voltage on here and then feeling each side. You're going to put your cold side onto a heat sink, and then you're going to put your hot side, the little metal plate right there, and then you're going to affix that. Um, that's kind of the shortfall for this, is it's a little difficult to figure out how to put it together properly. I'm not really mechanically inclined. My thing's more tech, but anyways, once that's done, you can apply a flame underneath and we'll get some voltage. We'll check that out. And this is basically what you'll end up with. What we have here is just a CPU cooler. It comes all the way down to here. This is our Pelche module. And that's a small piece of aluminum right there. I have screws running up inside of the heat sink. And I built a little cowl out of uh, uh, cardboard and the sc uh, screws act as legs. On the back end, all it is is the wires coming out from the Peltier, and I have them running to a small DC motor, and then all I did was just stuck a fan on there. It's not uh, permanently affixed. I just punched a hole in it and stuck it in there. So basically, now you can take this guy, get him in frame properly for you. We'll light a candle. Stick it underneath. And then I'll probably edit this out because it'll take a few minutes for it to heat up. And there we go. Now it's starting to spin on its own. And as it keeps going, it'll start building up more and more speed as the heat starts to get more built up. That's kind of the reason why I had to build that cowl around the bottom of it. Because it was actually spinning so fast it was blowing out a candle. So just as a little Easter egg too, is I'll have a video coming up soon that I have a little bit of a secondary plan with this guy and I think that you might like it. So in short, oh wow, look at that thing go. Yeah, it's pretty quick. So uh, have a good one YouTube. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, don't forget to hit uh, like, comment, and subscribe and share this with your friends.